Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Anton Builds. Today we're going to be making some guacamole. So what you're going to do is just going to get a couple of avocados, cut them in half, make sure they're nice and soft. Salt, pepper, garlic powder, real garlic's better, and some lemon juice. It's very simple. Take a spoon, like so. Take your avocados and you're just going to scoop them out like this. In one piece. Sometimes it's easier to slice them up a bit, but like this. Take them like this. Just watch your hands because they'll slice through and you'll slice your hand up. Usually just like that. And when you go to scoop it out, comes out little cubes. Like that. A little easier to mush up after. Okay, after you got all your avocados in the bowl, usually you don't make this much, but I love myself some guacamole. And uh, if you go to the store just before they're about to go bad, you can probably get them on sale too. But you're just gonna mush it up like this. Probably take a knife. I usually just go like this. Slice them up good. I'll usually just slice them up like this a bit, get them into nice big cubes. You don't really want to use a uh, food processor for this because it's more, I don't know, put some love into it. If I do, it's just doing it with a knife. Add some salt, some pepper. I usually add real garlic, but we don't have any right now. Garlic powder. I usually just do it to taste. And then I usually use a real lemon too, but I gotta use what you got. You can get yourself a fork. And you can just mush it down. So you get a nice consistency. Get some bigger pieces at the bottom and mix those up too. And just work it till you have like a consistency like this, like mushy almost, but still chunky. I'm just gonna try it every once in a while. See what it needs. I usually like pink Himalayan salt, not this stuff, but just go for taste. A couple of sprigs of parsley too. Just roll them up and just rip them apart. Sprinkle them in there. You just keep mushing it until it gets into the consistency you like. I like it half and half. Like this. It's almost perfect. See how it's like dippy but not. Mm. Delicious. A bit more for salt. A bit more lime. I'm going to 
consistency. That's what you want to see. Don't add too much because you can always add more. Yeah. Mmm. Delicious. And that's it. That's how you make a delicious guacamole. For your favorite restaurant style chips or whatever you like to use. And just give her a dip. Delicious.